Surprise snow! Even to us. So believe it or not, yesterday I cleaned that up. Oh, you guys have to check this out. No, you Move. don't. Knock it off, Connor. I've told you about your mouth. So I bought a bunch of butter because it was two sixty six a pound, oh, yeah. and it's really good. And so I'm pretty sure this is poo because I pulled them out of the bag this morning. <laughs> Watch out, Bagheera. Um. Okay, I just closed my door. Why is it open? It is too cold in here. Anyway, so... Actually, it looks like someone bit another box. Ended up picking up ten boxes, so... That'll take me almost through the whole year. Because we don't use it too much. Yep. Bagheera, stop stopping. That's my foot. <laughs> There's bite marks in that one. It looks like he just prefers unsalted. Real quick, I'm sure funny. Okay, hold on. Connor's taking you. Does he move your arm? <laughs> Is she coveting your waffles? Move your arm. Lex. Look how offended she is. <laughs> I'm sorry, did you do it and I didn't blame you? She always looks offended. Here, so she put her arm in her face. Okay. So, Goodbye. my nasty front room, but it's a work in progress. I have a bag of stuff in here that needs to be cleaned. Now, we're going into Xander's room. Bagheera, join me. Thank you. So as you can tell, he still thinks that that's going to work for me, but it's not. So here's Xander's bed, and I just picked him up a basket, and then we gave him the smaller couch. Lex helped me tremendously that day to get it in. Um, ooh, I wonder if he bent the tracks. No, he's just shoving too much stuff in there. Anyway, and so the boys each have their own room. Lexi's room is a disaster, but I did get rid of... Okay, Google, turn off the hall light. Um, she had a twin mattress on our futon and so we got rid of that yesterday along with the breakfast nook and so I was greatly appreciated those both went yesterday and so we've been fighting to get everything now situated because Anthony has trouble cleaning um, I do say he's a bit of a hoarder um, I do believe it's come from, you know, his mom and him not having much when they were little, or him when he was little, and so <coughs> I think that's partially why he keeps so much stuff, because we found a lot of trash. So here we go. <clears throat> As you can see, this is the before of the table, and... It is going to look much better as this video goes on, so thanks for joining us.
Connor decided you needed to see the cat really close up. As you can see, still working on the table, but much, much more progress. So we've eaten lunch, um, and now we're gonna walk outside. I don't know why the outside light's on. So I bought charcoal last night, they were $5 a bag. Well, they're sitting right here, and I don't need the bags wet. So we're gonna move them really quick. And I need to get some ice down on the stairs but I think it's buried right now so isn't this interesting nothing nothing this entire time so I didn't put the salt down I don't know why I said I needed it's salt slippery. it's not slippery not out back Okay, well, I was going to put some on the front stairs, but we're not getting deliveries right now, and we're not, but if it gets too warm, hi, you look like you're up to no good. In your neighborhood? Can you put a bag um, in? Yeah, I can put a bag in. <clears throat> so we'll kind of keep an eye on it and play it by ear. Tesla decided she needed love, but I had to get back to work, so I loved on her a second, and then I moved on back to the table. I think the hardest part is finding all of the places and homes for this stuff. But you can see we're doing we're doing little bits at a time is what it feels like to me. And now I'm off to laundry that is never ending.
If anyone says we're out of towels, this is where they were, obviously. All in this basket. If the snow wasn't bad enough, the wind is making it fairly interesting. So the snow and the wind were like this all day long. We ended up with probably about a foot and a half yesterday and we are snowing again today. working on the chair and actually what I'm doing right now is moving everything so one I can vacuum under it and two hopefully I can find the charger for the other camera which was no luck I ended up having to order a new one I try to vacuum under the furniture at least once a month, if not more. You see I'm watching royalty soaps. I'm obsessed with her. She makes me want to make soap. And then I realize that's a lot of work. that weirdo that will vacuum <laughs> my furniture. I find it to be easier, especially with three children that tend to shove stuff into the cushions. I don't know if you guys could tell, but there were a bunch of those flosser tooth picks. There was probably about 20 of them under this cushion. I feel like this lets people know where we live. What? Stop filming us outside. You're just showing just a building in snow right now. Well, yeah, but somebody can easily zoom in and there's addresses on the windows. It's a million towns in Oregon. So you see, it's gotten a little worse. There's one that's taken and it's taken. Search Gracie Cakes. See how many? Okay, Google. I don't think How you many can even, you can't even read.